guys, and welcome back to Leslie Through the Looking Glass. For those of you that are new here, hi, my name is Leslie. For my returning viewers, as always, thank you so much for coming back to support my channel. It really means so much. All right, guys, we are back with another Mental Health Monday video today. Um, life is crazy busy the last few days. Um, and today, <laughs> I'm actually trying to film this right before Amelia takes her nap so that I can get a bunch of stuff done while she's sleeping, um, which is when I usually film. But we had a family reunion the last two days. Um, my husband is amazing, and he was home Saturday morning, so he actually got a lot of my, like, the vacuuming done and a lot of my inside stuff that I get done on Sundays. So that was great. Um, I just have, like, some bathrooms to clean, laundry to put away, dishes to do, meal prep um, for a couple days this week, stuff like that. So not super far behind but it was just busy we had a family reunion on my husband's side and so that was two full days at my in-laws and it was very fun amelia had a blast she had lots of um kids to play with her age were a little bit older than her and they just had a great time playing the pool and swimming and running around um and today we start soccer so we were running around this morning to get some soccer stuff um for tonight's practice we usually do swim classes on Monday and we did not think we were going to be doing them because they did not have her normal swim class this month because of some stuff going on at the Y, but they just called now and said she got off the wait list for an afternoon class if we wanted to take it. Um, so that might be crazy because she will be swimming from 4 to 4.40 and going to soccer practice at 5 to 5.30. So we will probably have a very tired kid on Monday, but she really loves swim class and did not want to miss it. So we're going to try it. Um, and it's only for four weeks, worst case scenario. So. I'm learning a little bit to kind of adjust on the fly and go with the flow, um, but it's just a lot. So I will be packing um, our bag to get us all ready for that. I'm helping coach, and I'm excited and nervous about that because I have never um, coached. I've helped, like, um, gone and helped train a couple times for friends that were coaches because I played soccer my whole life. So when I was in high school, I helped teach some skills for younger kids, <laughs> but... Um, I haven't actually been coaching. I am the assistant. I'm not the head coach because the schedule doesn't work out that way. Um, but I'm really excited. So that'll be fun tonight. Um, and then tomorrow is the only day I work this week. And then I have some time off. So I'm really excited and looking forward to that. Um, I haven't been doing great on my self-care. I shouldn't say that. That's not true. I haven't needed to make specific time for myself for self-care. Um, where like I've needed to like go get out of the house or go do something. I have snuck in some easy stuff around the house that has helped me like taking a bath one day when she was napping and my husband had the monitor. Um, I built my Legos. I've never done Legos before so this was super fun for me. I built the Lego um, Magic Kingdom castle. So that was super fun um, and I could do that out by my husband while he was playing video games so we were spending time together but doing our own little hobby um so i've been doing things like that but it's been a few weeks since i like went and did anything or got out of the house um which a couple weeks ago i did some content and had a lot of fun doing that but since then i haven't like done that so i'm definitely going to try to work some of that into my time off if i can um but yeah so things are going pretty good and I'm, you know, I'm knowing now if after this really busy weekend that I might need to prioritize a little bit of me time at some point this week or weekend, next weekend. Um, and that's great. I'm glad that I'm to the point where I can recognize like I might need a little time. So I'm going to work on figuring something out for that. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much all that's going on here. Um, I am really excited <laughs> next week. I will be sharing, um, <laughs> are you playing peekaboo on the camera here? Yeah. <laughs> I will be sharing with you a new product I have been using. Um, I wanted to use it. <laughs> I wanted to use it and get some real experience with it before I decided to share it with you guys. This is why I usually film during nap time. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I wanted to really use it and get comfortable with it before I shared it and explained how it works specifically for me um, and share my actual experience with it. Okay. All right. So yeah. Um, 
But yeah, so I've been using that and I really like it. So I'm really excited to share it with you guys. Um, it's called Call Me Go and it helps with your breathing. Um, and that is something that I've struggled with from day one of being told to use that as a device or as a like coping mechanism or tool. Um, I had a really hard time and struggled with it a lot. Um, but this has been helping and it's a really, it is multi-sensory, so it really does a lot to help ground me when I'm feeling stressed out. So I will share all of that with you guys next week, but I just wanted to let you know that was coming because I'm really excited about it. Um, okay, stop. <laughs> Say bye. Okay. Toddlers make the world exciting, that's for sure. Um, but yeah, so that's really all I have. I'm excited to share that with you guys next week. Um, and kind of share with you just like how this week went and what I did to get myself back on track to a little smoother mindset after getting some making time. Millie. Okay, baby. Um, you can tell it's almost nap time. But yeah, so that's pretty much all we have. Um, I hope you guys are doing well and one second. Um, sorry. I, anyways. Hope you guys are doing good. Um, I feel like it's just a good week to start out positive. I'm not going into the week super stressed or coming out of the weekend super stressed, which isn't always the case. So I feel good about that. Um, let me know one thing you are proud of yourself for doing over the weekend or one thing you're looking forward to this week down in the comments. Um, and let's celebrate those things because that's important and helpful to the positive mindset. All right, guys, I hope you have a great week. I know this video is short and sweet, but that's all we got today. Um, I hope you have a great week. I will see you this weekend for something. I'm not sure what I will be doing this weekend. Um, probably talking about Hollywood Studios. Maybe? I don't know. We'll see. Um, but I'll be doing a park this weekend on my video, and I will see you guys then. Have a great night, or a great day. Bye, guys.